A person is neither a thing nor a process, but an opening through which the Absolute can manifest. Nothing is everything that doesn't happen at this very moment. Man acts as though he were the shaper and master of language, while in fact, language remains the master of man. Everyone is the other and no one is himself. Dwelling is not primarily inhabiting, but taking care of and creating that space within which something comes into its own and flourishes. How one encounters reality is a choice. If I take death into my life, acknowledge it, and face it squarely, I will free myself from the anxiety of death and the pettiness of life, and only then will I be free to become myself. We should never allow our fears or the expectations of others to set the frontiers of our destiny. Every man is born as many men and dies as a single one. A boundary is not that at which something stops, but that from which something begins. The most thought-provoking thing in our thought-provoking time is that we are still not thinking. Language is the house of being. In its home man dwells. Those who think and those who create with words are the guardians of this home. We make a space inside ourselves so that being can speak. Thinking begins only when we have come to know that reason, glorified for centuries, is the stiff-necked adversary of thought. The small are always dependent on the great. They are small precisely because they think they are independent. The great thinker is one who can hear what is greatest in the work of other greats and who can transform it in an original manner. Transcendence constitutes selfhood. We do not say, being is, time is, but rather, there is being and there is time. Questioning is the piety of thought. Spiritual superiority consists in deep dedication, in the form of the most rigorous training as commitment, resistance, solitude, and love. We do not have a body, rather, we are bodily. The human being is not the lord of beings, but the shepherd of being.
we should live totally in the face of the night and of the evil. Being and time determine each other reciprocally, but in such a manner that neither can the former being be addressed as something temporal nor can the latter time be addressed as a being. To be a poet in a destitute time means to attend, singing to the trace of the fugitive gods. This is why the poet in the time of the world's night utters the holy. Tell me how you read and I'll tell you who you are. Only where leader and led together bind each other in one destiny does true order grow. The possible ranks higher than the actual. Truth is that which makes a people certain, clear, and strong. Longing is the agony of the nearness of the distant. To think is to confine yourself to a single thought that one day stands still like a star in the world sky. Being is only being for Dasin. Philosophy will not be able to affect an immediate transformation of the present condition of the world. This is not only true of philosophy, but of all merely human thought and endeavor. In order to remain silent, Dawsane must have something to say. To dwell is to garden. Making itself intelligible is suicide for philosophy. The relationship between man and space is none other than a dwelling, strictly thought and spoken. True time is four-dimensional. In everything well known, something worthy of thought still lurks. What was Aristotle's life? Well, the answer lay in a single sentence. He was born, he thought, he died, and all the rest is pure anecdote. I know that everything essential and great originated from the fact that the human being had a homeland and was rooted in tradition. But what is great can only begin great. Only if we are capable of dwelling, only then can we build. The question concerning technology is the question concerning the constellation in which revealing and concealing, in which the coming to presence of truth comes to pass. We ourselves are the entities to be analyzed.
The will to mastery becomes all the more urgent the more technology threatens to slip from human control. Understanding of being is itself a determination of being of Dawsein. We would like only, for once, to get to where we are already. Temporality temporalizes as a future which makes present in the process of having been. When modern physics exerts itself to establish the world's formula, what occurs thereby is this, the being of entities has resolved itself into the method of the totally calculable, The relation of feeling toward art and its bringing forth can be one of production or one of reception and enjoyment. Nature has no history. A resounding of the authentic word can arise only from silence. If in Nietzsche's thinking the prior tradition of Western thought is gathered and completed in a decisive respect, then the confrontation with Nietzsche becomes one with all Western thought hitherto. Man dies constantly until the moment of his demise. Mere anxiety is the source of everything. Technology is a mode of revealing. Technology comes to presence in the realm where revealing and unconcealment take place, where aletheia, truth, happens. He who never says anything cannot keep silent at any given moment. All the poems of the poet who has entered into his poethood are poems of homecoming. Nothing religious is ever destroyed by logic. It is destroyed only by the God's withdrawal. Only a God can save us. Which of the quotes do you like the most? Please leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.